I mean, I'm saying what kind of deal is today? It's literally what time is it? <laughs> 1 p.m. 1 p.m. This is my life right now. I've never been more unproductive. So, let's get ready and change it around. I can't believe it. I need coffee, let's go. Oh my God, I just broke my clip. What a joke. Oh God. Donkey. Wow, I never thought I <laughs> I never thought that this is the type of content I'll be putting out on YouTube. <laughs> Literally me washing my face. But this is lifestyle, this is the day in the life, this is real life. I should just get my tripod out. I don't know why the hell I'm making my life so difficult. But anyway, I love the way that this cleanser feels. It feels so so nice on the skin. I have one of these. It's a cleansing cloud by e.l.f. It's supposed to like get rid of any makeup or anything like that. So I'm just going to use that as well. Um, but yeah, just to make sure I don't have any remaining makeup or anything like that. Oh, my legs. Just applying that to a slightly damp Face. Working that in. Do you see how that kind of just gives you like that glass skin? Love how this feels. Just bring it down to my neck. It's light and it's not it. My moisturizer. I'm just using Nivea at the moment, to be honest, guys. Let's go and make some breakfast. I literally went to bed at 4 a.m. Absolutely no lie. Last night I went to bed at 4 a.m. That's why I've had <coughs> my oh my morning boy. Lisa. <coughs> Good afternoon. Hello, Charlie. <laughs> Why am I here? I need to go to the kitchen. Oh, all I want to do is sit on the couch and chill. Why? First things first, guys, let's make a coffee. Let me turn on the lights. Turn on the lights in here, baby. Make myself a big mug of coffee. Oh my god, nothing better. Nothing better. And I think I'm just, while I figure out what I want for breakfast, I might just have one of these madeleines. Because I'm starving, literally, I'm starving. <laughs> Oh, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot, Rachel. Thanks a lot. Oh, everything's just jarring me today. It's not a good day. I think once I'm done with breakfast, I'm going to pick up my room a little bit. And then I will jump in the shower and start getting ready for today. Um, Even though it's super late right now. I'll tell you why I was up late later. But yeah, not feeling like myself today. Hmm. I'm not even doing my period. That's the thing. Like, why am I feeling so off? <laughs> jumper since the whole mafia what is it mafia wife thing is trending now that is gonna be the outfit that is gonna be the outfit cash and warm how's that i don't really know how i feel i don't really know how i feel on oh, my pillow i don't really know how i feel about this this how cute is this ring that i purchased for valentine's day like it's got a little heart it's from every jewels it's so adorable i absolutely love it i've also got this one like a pink stone heart it's also from every jewels but it's silver i don't think i'm fancy in silver right now this look is giving gold so i think i'm gonna go for this ring today um i think these earrings will be so cute as well so i'm gonna wear these I need to sort out my whole tripod situation because this is not comfortable. Story of my life. Yeah, you're, you're on Rosie's. Enough is enough, darling. You're on Rosie's little treehouse. <laughs> that is my tripod for today. I am, I'm trying to turn this day around, guys. I think I might go for a walk as well. I think I, I need that to uplift my spirits. Yeah, we were dancing. Hi, Rosie. Anyway. Let's go make some lunch. Yeah, this is definitely one of my main issues. This is definitely the main cause of my mood. And then over there, it wants to be sunny. For what reason? When over here, over me, it's so cloudy. 
the mess in the background really okay i need to clean the kitchen but look at this so adorable i love this ring hello everyone welcome back to another video i hope you are all doing well if you are new here my name is muna welcome to my channel i'd love for you to subscribe and stick around i'm trying to reach 400 subscribers right now and it would mean the world to me if you subscribe to my channel last night i just i decided I'm making a change. I'm changing my life. Also, don't even watch my messy kitchen. I'm gonna clean it in a second. I'm just, I don't know why I'm in a funk. I'm in a, I'm in a, I hate everyone mood. I don't know why. I'm not even due on my period. I don't know what's going on with me, but I've just not been feeling like myself today. So I thought I would turn that around. I got out of bed at like 1 p.m. Like, what the hell? I went from being a productive queen all up until now so i need to get my act back together and i'm not gonna let myself dwell on this too much i'm literally going to flip the switch as ray says okay because it's not acceptable and i don't want to go back into waking up in the early afternoon like for what i've missed all of the day and you know what it actually is it's my own fault it's my own fault because last night i started off i was just having a mare day because it was a saturday and i had no plans i was just chilling watching tv i started off with watching the real housewives of salt lake city i should actually cook and eat or do a mukbang and talk but i'll go more into it later yeah i started watching the real housewives of salt lake city i'm now on season two uh, that says a lot. Okay, I started from season 1 episode 1. So I'm on season 2 episode 4 or something like that. So I watched the whole thing. Just literally a grown woman in their late 40s, 50s, nagging at each other and just bickering. Literally that's what it is, bickering at each other. But it's entertainment, I enjoyed it. And then I made the stupid mistake of starting a new show on Netflix. Thinking, yeah, I'll just watch two episodes and I'll go to sleep. <laughs> I need to know my limits. I'm not that kind of gal. I'm not that kind of gal to watch one or two episodes of a show and then stop watching it. That's not who I am. That's not who I am. Well, I knew that in the first place, but I don't accept it. I always do the same fucking shit. <laughs> That's not gonna happen again. I say that, but watch me do it again next time. But I started watching One Day. Also, that guy on One Day, yeah. It's the same guy from White Lotus. I don't really know him in anything else that I've seen. Like, I haven't personally seen him in anything else but White Lotus. And I remember thinking, oh, he's a bit of a, you know, a lad, like, bad boy. Like, you know what I mean? He plays that character so well. And then in this show as well, he's that. But there's a bit of a more emotional and sensitive side to him as well that we get to see. And yesterday, the only reason why I went to sleep was because I looked down on my phone it was half four in the morning who do i think i am genuinely and then also it's like i was like you know what you've binged the whole thing save some for tomorrow you know netflix right now doesn't have that many amazing shows save it savor it so that's the only reason why i stopped watching i'm going to be picking that up today uh, and watching more of that but literally yesterday I, it, it gave me i was so into it see i need more shows like this this is why i think i need to watch normal people because i feel like normal people will be on the along the lines of this and i love that i love i, I love those types of shows you know it's sad it's emotional but i I, just, I love them it gives love rosie that kind of vibe like right person wrong time or like not miscommunication because that trope is kind of a hit or miss for me personally but it's like they don't confess their feelings and then like something happens or like years go down the line like you see a timeline right and i just thought that that is just so cute it's so cute because it's actually realistic i really enjoyed that that show and i'm going to continue watching it but i want to watch normal people but the thing is i read the book i read the beginning of the book and i, I dnf'd it so that's why it's kind of uh, i don't know made me a bit hesitant to watch the show as well but you never know i might enjoy it i need to give it a chance but one day oh my god it's so good it gives me like I don't know, like those kind of films, just it's, it's cute, the love interest is a bit quirky, like I love those kind of films, I love those kind of films. It's the same as, I'll put it up here, but the, the, the love at first sight, like that kind of vibe, right? It's just wholesome, it's just a wholesome romantic like show, like I like it, it's just a wholesome feeling. I don't know if you're going to get what I'm saying, if what I'm saying is delivering, but you know what I mean, like those kind of wholesome movies or shows i love those kind of programs so i think i will enjoy normal people i think i need to give it a chance okay i've rambled on enough you know what talking to you guys has lifted my spirits a little bit it's made me a bit more as cliche as it sounds it's made me happier <laughs> so yeah i was not in the mood today i wanted to sleep in until about three 
It's giving low-key, it's giving depressing. Like, what is this? Yes, just because I have nothing to do this week and I was like, you know what, you stayed up, like, why not? Sometimes sitting in front of the TV and just binge watching your shows is, is needed, you know? And now it's getting back into productivity, getting back into being motivated. So let's make a, a lunch. I'm thinking maybe some rice and chicken. Like, I have these um, chicken wings from Sainsbury's. I can just pop them in the air fryer. I'll show you, actually. They look like this. They're like hot wings and yeah hot and spicy chicken i'm so glad peace out a town also how can i watch the super bowl like live in the uk is there a way to do that by the time this goes up the super bowl would have way happened i don't know i want to watch it live because i want to see if taylor swift is there <laughs> i'm sorry don't come for me okay I'm from England. I don't watch what rugby is it or American football or whatever, and I don't really know the teams. I don't know. I don't know nothing about it. Also, who was? This is how you know I haven't talked to anyone today because I'm chatting you guys' ears off. I'm so sorry, but um, who clowned that reputation was coming? Who clowned? Be truthful because. I was clowning. As soon as she changed her profile picture to black and white, black and white, I was clowning that I was sending it to everyone, my friends, family, everyone saying reputation is coming, my favorite era is coming, and I was ready for those vault tracks. You know, I wanna I wanna know I want you to dish out the secrets and dish out the goss. Like, you know, I'm ready for it. Are you ready for it? But yeah, literally. And then she comes out with a new album. I'm gagging. Like literally, new album! I'm thinking it, it's gonna be like Folklore's sister. And Folklore is my favorite album. It's one of my favorite albums. So I can't wait. I've realized I love when Taylor Swift has like more of a piano background, like a piano playing in the back. Like that, those kind of songs I know will hit my feels. Like Tolerate It. <laughs> I just died. I don't know what that noise was as well. Yeah, I hope it's something like that. Like she deep dives into her. I mean, it's like poetry, right? So I'm sure she's going to deep dive into her feelings. She has to, right? She has to. Oh my God, I'm so excited. And then Ariana Grande's album is coming out as well. Do you know what? Yeah, I can't lie. Yes, and is a bop. It's very catchy and literally like I can't get it out of my mind and I'm singing it all the time. But I don't know. It's not, it's not giving positions. Like I'm not in love with it like I was with her other songs. I can't lie. Maybe because I'm not into the whole oh disco whatever it is you know the instrumental is not for me personally but yeah do you know what will cheer me up let's go book shopping <laughs> let's go book shopping nobody knows me better like you oh, i don't even know the words but i'm obsessed twin where have you been get my phone where's my phone anyone else obsessed with this song it's called made for me by money long I could eat this song. Oh, oh my god. She knows what she's doing every single time. She knows what she's doing. And just before Valentine's Day as well. Perfect timing. It's to the song. like 90s are of oh I, i'm just so in i am so in love with this song it's so adorable Another one that's on constant repeat right now. I love that. Such a beautiful song. Do you know what? Yeah, listening to these kind of like old school R&B songs got me thinking about B5. Who remembers them? I had the biggest crush on them in high school. <laughs> I had a crush on them in high school. I was like, oh my god. This is all I do by B5. So cute. It's like 
five brothers who all sing together. They range in different ages and their voices are just... Each day, baby, baby, it's my favorite bit. Baby, oh, oh, all I do is think about you day and night. I can't even sleep without you in my life. <laughs> oh my god, this is going down memory lane. I need my rice. I'm adding some curry powder, some garlic, granules. Oh shit, I didn't boil the kettle for the water. Oh, oh. I'm gonna add some veggies, like just like some cut up veggies, just to make it like a vegetable rice situation. Really? Pour it in the kettle. Ah! I'm going to add some salt. I can't even sleep without you in my life. So, while that's cooking, I think I'm just gonna do a little bit of tidy up in the kitchen, put the dirty dishes in the dishwasher, put the plates from the dishwasher away. So, yeah, let's just get it. Let's continue with the tunes. I've got an RB playlist going on. Oh, Mariah Carey! I'm gonna get copyright for this shade, but I didn't mean it when I said I didn't love you so. I never should have let you go. I didn't know nothing, I was stupid, I was foolish, I was lying to myself. Let's go. Cause baby, when you left, I lost a part of me. It's still so hard to believe. Come back, baby, please. My favorite part. I can sleep at night when you're wrong. Wait a minute, this is too deep, too deep. I gotta change the station so I. And then I hear a baby face. <laughs> It is all clean. 
sick. No, but what the heck? Something literally just took a chunk out of my freaking thumb. What the heck? I don't know what the hell happened. Let's plate up my lunch. It's a very late lunch. Some rice with a bit of veg. And I've got the chicken that was in the air fryer. I would chop up some salad, but can I really be asked? The answer is no, no, no. A glass of cola. Probably going to watch an episode of One Day. I'll eat my lunch while I'm watching that, basically. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've really mastered the art of rice. I really have. Don't mean to toot my own horn, but I really have. Last episode I watched it, literally I wish I had a camera like on the wall somewhere because my reaction was the most hilarious reaction ever. I don't want to give spoilers, but if you haven't seen oh, should I say it? I don't know, I don't think I should. I feel like you're a bit far. <laughs> you're a bit far away. I've also been watching Griselda as well, so I've been enjoying that. Now I'm on to one day. Episode 11, here we go. How many more episodes do I have left? Three more episodes, oh my god, that is so good. It's so weird though, because like, she found out that he's gonna have, oh, I, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna ruin it, I'm not gonna ruin it, I'm not gonna, I'm not, no, 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 I'm not gonna say anything. So, season one, episode 11, here we go, I'm not ready. Is he working in the coffee shop? Back in the midst of time. He's working in the coffee shop now. Large in it or something. This is actually, us navigating life she because what happened to you then mate don't know still trying to work that one out cool who are you get out yeah, I mean. oh <laughs> yeah apparently it's not enough to write a book <laughs> not him looking after the baby like this please i'm so worried okay he's, he's doing all right oh he's so cute whose baby is that <laughs> he's acting like it's his baby no more babies. I mean, just Did he just leave the baby in the house? <laughs> Is it drink wine every day? No, he's actually. We're just feeling that way. Oh my god! He has a way with words, I'm telling you now. He has a way with words. Why is she acting so sus? What's going on? See you tomorrow. Huh? Is she cheating on him? You too. <gasps> Every other word is a heart. Yeah, okay. We've seen this. Destiny's child's already told us about this. Turn the camera. Let me see. Who else is in the room? Who else? Could it be the you? I mean, could it be the lady? Oh, Fush. Okay. Not really. Not really. Yep, I knew. Oh, what the fuck? I'm sure he's fine. Ain't that his friend? <gasps> oh my <laughs> god. Go go. While he's at home with your baby. Yeah. This I'm is gonna take you home. This is wild. This is wild. Hey, I heard you were a wild one. See? The episode ends and then I'm like Next. Next, honey. I'm always intrigued to see like when they will jump again. Don't think he's working at the shop anymore, the cafe. He looks different. Oh, he's reading her book. I love her hair. The long box. Can you imagine there's people in this world that have this kind of connection with someone? It's July 1999 in Paris. Okay. It's a small talk for me as well. Yeah, I love it here. It's changed. Paris it looks so nice on films and stuff, but. Ah! You look beautiful! So, so where was all this talk before? Huh? Where was this chat before, so eh? Nice. Where was it? Where was it? That was a waste of fucking money. Oh, damn. But it's not where I came. Okay, what, 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 okay. what, 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 say, say, say. I mean, we should talk about it. What happened? Oh, yeah. We can, Plato. She is protecting her feelings and he's like, not saying. So it's like, they're never gonna get to... Do you know what I mean? I wonder how they're not gonna tell us how it happened. Did he find out that she was having an affair? Like, what is? I need more. De I need more details. I have something. What? What happened now? Every single time, there's something that happens. I just did get past page four. Remember, I thought it was wonderful. No, do you know what? Yeah. He's actually a bit funny, I can't lie, he's actually a little bit, a little bit funny. If someone said that to me, I didn't get past page four of my book. Damn! It's just such an easy watch. I could sit here all day and watch this. What time is it? 
It's 4.30, oh my god. And I wanted to go on a walk as well. I better go before it starts getting dark. Do you know what? Yeah, guys, I don't think I'm gonna actually like put on any makeup. Don't really fancy it that much. I think I'm just gonna put a bit of... A bit of maybe lip liner and maybe mascara. I don't even know. I'm probably gonna regret it editing it when you can see my bags. But, right, maybe a little tint of lips. I mean, I'm only going for a walk. I've run out of my Fenty. I'm so sad about this. I've run out of my Fenty. I need to buy another one. I think that is it. This clip is actually being so annoying, but I'm just gonna go take a walk and then probably come back. Maybe I'll read a little bit. I wanna read a little bit and I wanna plan for tomorrow, like what I'm doing tomorrow, because tomorrow I want it to be really productive. Do you know what? That's also another thing that really helps is fresh air. So I'm going to go get some fresh air. I think it will be good in making me feel better. So let's go. because I've got it ends with us at home. So this would be a good addition. I don't know if it's any good, but we shall see. Hey, hey, hey. That was a nice little walk that I did. I went into Powerland, yeah, and I saw that they did this Dove Pink. I've used Dove um, soaps before, but I've never seen this pink one ever. And I saw a girl using it in like her get ready with me or something like that. It was a video. She said it was really nice. So I wanted to try it out and see. Like, I wonder what the fragrance is gonna be. It doesn't say dermatologically. Why is that so hard to say? Dermatologically. Dermato dermatolo say that ten times. Oh my god. Dermatolog dermatologic term ah! Ah! Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm dead. Wait, dermatologically. Is that right? Dermato dermatology dermatologically. <laughs> Approved. Why does it sound so weird when I say it? Derma, derma, touch, derma. Uh, do you know what? You know what I mean. Derma, touch, no, forget it, forget it, forget it. But yeah, so I'm excited to try that out. And then I got the second book to It Ends With Us. Every ending has a beginning. So now I've got both It Ends With Us and I've got It Starts With Us as well. Is this, this is a prequel, right? But it came out after It Ends With Us. So technically I've got both and I haven't started either one. So should I be reading this one first, even though it came out second? Let me know, guys. Please let me know your opinion on that because I genuinely want to know what order I should read it in and what order makes more sense. Or or should I just go along with everyone else and just read it as the order it came out? So it ends with us first and then this one. Maybe I'll do that, who knows? I am super excited to try this out. Hey guys, I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you enjoyed this video. Turned it around in the end. We had a great day. Bit of productivity, but you know, a balance. Like a bit of chilling, a bit of productivity. Like I feel really good now. And I'm glad that I turned this day around. If you're having a shitty day, just remember you could always turn it around, put some good tunes on that make you happy and do something that you love, right? Oh, I've got these red nails. These are very, very long. Oh my goodness me. Mary's so unintentionally funny. Oh my God, no, my finger's glued. What do you guys think? The heart, my February vision board. Red theme going on. So I really like this. I really like this. This is how it's looking. I'm absolutely in love with it. Mm -hmm.